Surprise, everyone. Sorry, hit the tripod. I got a bad habit of that. Um, I'm here. I had to go get my car serviced. Ended up coming home with a new car and bought stuff. So, yeah. Intentions were not to buy a new one, but I did. So, I'll go over quickly what I got. I went to Hobby Lobby and I went to Michael's. Um, we'll start with Hobby Lobby first because it's the biggest one. Um, their Christmas stuff is 50% off. Their paper studio is 40 So I grabbed two of the heavyweight 80-pound card stocks. And because I didn't have any more, well, I had very few pieces of black paper left. Let's put it that way. I thought I had a package of this Hobby Lobby paper somewhere, but I can't find it anywhere. Now I'll probably find it because I bought two. But so they were 40 off, and then I bought single sheets. I bought a dozen, or I'm sorry, 10 of the 12 by 12. So no big thing there. Um... Uh, let's see, the the paper, the paper was $5.99 each, the, the big packages, the, the eight and a half by 11. The single sheets, they were 79 cents. She didn't give me 10, the 40% off on those. Maybe they're not listed as Paper Studio. That I see. You might want to check that. There's no name on them. That's probably why she didn't. But it's over there with the paper. So I just happened to see that, or I would have said something. But I'm not going back to, to argue about it. Okay. So most of the stuff I got was Christmas. Um, I found those, and all of the. There's only couple things in here that were not in the Christmas line, but they were Christmas, and they were only 40% off. So, I got some charms. Um, I bought a couple of oops, these guys. Well, they're backward. One's backward, one's not. I bought the snowman. There you go. That's better. And Christmas trees. I got a few gingerbread houses to finish from Anna Griffin, and I was going to use those on the insides of them. Then I bought um I think there's one, two, three. There's four of these. Santa, Mrs. Claus, and the reindeer. Rudolph doesn't have a red nose on there. Um, there's only three to a pack, so um, I thought those were cute, if you can see them. Then I, I think I have the gingerbread men, but I, or gingerbreads. I bought them again, just in case I didn't. And those are buttons, but we know we can use those for other things. Um... Then I bought these acrylic tags. Um, they came in packs of 10. That's why I bought five of them. I thought maybe for the craft fair next year I could do something with them. You don't have to use them for Christmas. There's nothing screaming Christmas here about them. So I bought five packs of 10. So um, yeah, try to figure something out with those. Um, I bought these. Um, earrings, but I'm going to take them off and use the dangles for something else. And I bought another pair of them. I wondered what was jingling in my bag. It's those. They're jingle bells. Actually, you could take those jingle bells off and use them separately, too, if you wanted to. I uh, bought two of these gingerbread charms. They were just cute. I'll figure out something to do with them. I haven't been to Hobby Lobby in a while, so, yeah. Um, yeah, I don't remember last time I've been there. 
Um, but the Rudolph stickers. These were new to me this year. They may have been there last year, but I don't, I didn't, I only went one time last year. So some of the stuff may have come out last year that I didn't know about. These were just cute. I thought for the boys Christmas cards I make for my mom to give out. I thought for the little boys, those might be cute. They, one of them likes dinosaurs. The other one will like dinosaurs because they're going to get, both of them are going to get one. And I think I have these, but I just bought some more. Uh, they're wood. And then I bought one each of these. And these are the other two Christmas things that were 40% off. I don't remember these either, so those were cute. All right, so that's all from Hobby Lobby. Um, Michael's. I Googled yesterday before I went to get my car done to find out if anybody had any Cricut Joy Extra mats in the area I was going. Nobody did, according to websites everywhere, including Michael's. I had a $20 off. $20 reward coupon because I just bought that extra there. So I thought, well, I'm going to go check it out just in case. Well, good thing I did because look what I found. A mat. Yeah. So now I can do other things while I'm waiting. I ordered some from Cricut and I ordered some from Amazon. The mats aren't here yet. So I couldn't just do anything but cards. And actually... I'll get those and show you what I did last night. I was just playing with it. Um, so I'll show you those when I'm done. Um, so we'll put those there for the moment. Then I bought another one of these. Oh, I ordered HSN too. HSN's got, I got a haul coming from them too that is this extra stuff. Um, this is printable vinyl and it came with the HSN um, bundle. But I bought more because I thought that might be interesting. You could make your own stuff. This paper pad was $4.99. And the only reason I got it was because it's lemons. And I got that lemon dye and stencil from Crafters Companions warehouse sale. I didn't even have any lemon paper. So, this was perfect. Um, I definitely don't have to go overboard buying lemon stuff for just two things. But, I have a couple other lemon things too. But, so, I bought that paper to go with it for five bucks. Why not? And, then I bought a three-pack of vinyl, smart vinyl for the extra I bought this same collection off of Cricut. If you're looking for stuff at Cricut, for any of your Cricut machines, um, everything is half price at the moment at Cricut.com. But I want this any another one of those. So I just bought one. I think that gives me three now because I think I bought um, two of them from Cricut. So... The mat that I bought and whatever else I bought from Cricut was a whole lot cheaper than the package I just bought off HSN, the stuff I ordered from Amazon, and the stuff I just bought. It was a it was a whole lot cheaper half price. But stuff in the stores is not half price. So if you're looking, go to Cricut. I bought that pack of cards because I liked the 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 foil paper. And then I just bought this ghosty because it was on sale. Um, and then I just bought some M&M's. I think that is it. So, I, um, stimulated the economy today, needless to say, with buying the car, but that's okay. I get to play with my Cricut Joy now, the extra. So, um, I'm happy I found a mat that I can play with and, instead of waiting. So, I'll probably, probably fool with that tomorrow. I have to study for a test. My midterm's coming up, so I need to study for that tomorrow. I worked on it some today while I was doing, fooling with all that car stuff. I wasn't planning on being down there all day, but it ended up being all day. So, I gotta buckle down and study for my test. 
All right, so here's card number one I made yesterday. I didn't put anything on the inside yet. Cut great. Used the pen. I had never used the pen feature on any of my stuff, so that came out cute. This one I love to my boo. So, yeah, the pen works great. The pen features, I never have used them. That's the first time I've used them. This one did not cut quite so well, because if you look at the P, look at the A, look at the W, it did not cut quite so well. So, I gave it to one of the kids. They won't know the difference. But, yeah, that you have to watch, because even though it's a different machine and supposed to have better technology, and those were not even small. So, just beware. Some of the stuff, it's just not going to cut right, no matter what you do, unless you increase the font. I don't know else how else to make it work, but one of the kids will not even pay attention to it, to be honest. So, um, so anyway, that's my little haul and my little projects here for tonight. And I will catch y'all in the next video because now i got to put all this stuff away and find a place to put it. Um, have a good Sunday, and I'll catch you in the next video.